Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars. Coming to you from the newly renovated Alien Artifacts in Jumioni on SecondLife.com. Today we're going to look at Spirit Soul 519, some really remarkable things that are in it. So let's go ahead and go ahead. Go ahead and go on down and teleport on up to the room where we're going to take a look at the model and the photo. This will be a multi-part photo because it's very complex. I have another uh, model, it's actually a model board that I'm using and this model board has an incredible array of stuff on it. There are pipes and everything else in this photo. I've never seen anything like it. But today we're just going to stay simple and look at the model and photo. First photo and then we'll take a look at the model. And I'm adjusting Okay, right here's our uh, building, a very distant structure. But there's no way that nature could have formed this. I believe that these are two rectangular observation ports or windows, whatever their fu main function is or was. We can see them very clearly. There's an object in front of this one that's kind of sticking up. There's more stuff in front of the other one. Well, these are two polygons, and the odds of finding something like this are, you know, astronomical. Again, you're not going to find natural formation like this, and that's the point. It's not natural. Well, it's been ignored by NASA, very clearly ignored by NASA. All right, uh, up here, we have kind of a half moon cylinder heads down and there's a circular thing which is on top of the structure I'm not going to do a model for that because I'm not certain exactly what we have there interesting over the right we look really carefully and we can see just a little wizzy area sticking up above the horizon that goes down here I believe this to be a uh, bush or something right at the extreme edge of the photo. As a matter of fact, we have quite a few things right in here. This whole photo is so packed full of vegetation, I have a difficult time picking some of the things out. And then down here, we have what, what looks like a pipe sticking up and going across. Pipes are pretty common in this photo. I was really impressed with it overall. Here we have another pipe right here. All sorts of interesting things here. Now we're going to go over and take a look at the model and discuss that. The model which I based on this structure up here. You gotta adjust the camera angles again. Here's Artifacts of Mars Omega Man. That's my avatar. Alright, this is what I believe that building uh, looks like, basically. There may be a few ridges on top of it. I think there are. I didn't incorporate those into this model. What you can see is a simple, basic, disc-shaped-like building. What's it doing on Mars? Well... That's not, that's what we're not being told. I don't know. I believe it to be an observation post of some sort, but I could be wrong. The point here is it's not natural. And NASA needs to be held to account. They need to answer the public and tell us exactly what it is that they found. And I am going to kick and scream 
for as long as I can and complain everything else until we get some answers. Because there is no morality side behind withholding this from the public, giving us this light bowl that there's nothing but rocks and more rocks on that planet. It's bull. I ain't damn sick and tired of it, to be honest with you. Alright, well that's going to wrap it today. Like I said, this is an introductory video. I have some really incredible things to show. But we're going to start out with this video and then work our way up. The next video I'm going to show some uh, definite pipes. One is so blatant, I don't know how anyone can miss it if you study the photo really well. These are all on the small side, and some of them are a little bit speculative, but not the pipes. That's going to be it. I thank you for watching. This is Spirit Soul 519, and I'm Artifacts of Mars, wishing you a happy and healthy day.